So volunteering, part-time jobs, community work, entrepreneurship, and informal jobs. So counteract, this is to cancel something out or to work against it. An entrepreneur, I love this word, polyfrancais, it's a French word. A person who sees opportunity to start a business or offer a service. Very beautiful word. Informal jobs, these are jobs where you work for yourself. Uh, Formal jobs, these are jobs where you work for an employer or you have some kind of job contract. Volunteering, this is whereby a person assists others by giving their time and skills without expecting any payment. And it makes people feel good about themselves because you are doing something out of the goodness of your own heart. It also builds confidence by working with others and it allows people to explore their interests. So a year and a half ago, I'm joking, just half a year ago, I I volunteered uh, and I taught English in Cambodia. Literally, best experience of my life, man. Could not recommend it anymore. It was awesome engaging with uh, Khmer individuals. So they are Khmer people, Khmer speaking. And so lovely. Um, I stayed in a traditional Cambodian house as well. Ate ca- uh, tra- traditional Cambodian food over a week or so. And all in all, it was just an absolutely amazing experience. I loved literally every part of it. It was awesome and I'll cherish those memories forever. Teaching the ABCs, teaching colors, body parts, playing games, uh, playing some football, volleyball. Volunteering was amazing. Uh, It made me feel amazing about myself. It built so much confidence, so much character. And um, I think I I left an overall net positive there uh, in my time in Siem Reap, Cambodia. Volunteers, they receive a letter or certificate uh, to state what kind of work was done as well. In terms of part-time jobs, a part-time job is whereby you work for a short while and gain a lot of experience because of being able to have more than one job at a time. So, you know, you can work like three or four part-time jobs here and there. When I was at university, I I tutored part-time. I didn't use under any brand. Well, I founded my own brand, my friend. And I was just 18 years old when I I did it. You know, I just, I couldn't rely on anyone uh, to pay me a salary and just the ugliness of, you know, finding a decent employer, getting a decent amount of time of work per week. It just, yeah, it wasn't for me. So I founded my own brand. And for me, that was the best decision. And I honestly, it started off part time and then I was working full time, literally eight hours a day, compromising my university work just to build this tuition brand. And yeah, this uh, led me to YouTube to just give it out for, for free, doing my bit of work, my uh, service to humanity, to the matrix in South Africa. Community work, it means that a person does something to benefit their community or a community in need. Uh, The work is usually paid for by a government or an NGO or a religious-based organization. Okay, community work, you know, just uplifting the area that you're in. It could be like a non-government organization or like a not-for-profit organization or something to do with uh, religion, like some, maybe some missionary work or like feeding schemes and things like that. I know there's a lot of Hare Krishna temples uh, in Durban that do a lot of feeding schemes. In terms of entrepreneurship, an entrepreneur sees a need and provides a good or service to satisfy needs. So, look, just seeing a gap, providing the good or services uh, or service to to meet that gap. In terms of informal jobs, so informal jobs are usually a lot more short term and they have flexible hours. And it allows people to balance family responsibilities because it's flexible and you can give more time to your family.